Marching videos. Appreciate the pit view, thank you very much. <laughs> Electric violin in a drum corset. Oh man, this, <laughs> this drum edge is like, yeah, yeah. The marimba is over here. That's very interesting. There must be some sort of very fancy party trick coming up. Whoa. What? Whoa! Ho, ho, ho. With the with the stanky arm! I can do that too. Look, 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 ready? Oh Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another episode of The Studio. My name is Adam, and it's time for yet another episode of Let's Watch. Thank you so much to my studio VIPs, Robert Utomo, Wolf Lena, Marimba Maurice, Ryan Carlisle, Sunshine Hines, Scott Raider, Greg Harris, Dom Zomni Chung, DMP Newberger, and Bradley Crowley. Thank you so much for your continued support. And today's featured studio artist is Rachel Lipson. Thank you so much for joining the studio artist team. And if you'd like to become a studio VIP or a studio artist, you can go to patreon.com forward slash untan, or you can click over here. Welcome back to the show once again. Hope you've been well. Hope you've been staying safe. And yes, today we're going to be watching more marching videos yes i'm really excited to watch two new videos of marching content on the channel because you guys are still submitting so much marching content at adamcampercussion.com forward slash submit if you ever want to submit anything to be featured on the show you can submit it right there by the way for the first time on this show i now have a partnership with a company that i'm sure all of you guys are familiar with it's none other than NordVPN. With over 5,100 servers in 59 countries across the world, NordVPN is the largest and most popular VPN provider in the world. So I'm very pleased to be able to give you guys a discount of 70% off and one month free on a brand new NordVPN three-year plan. And to get that discount, all you have to do is go to adamcampercussion.com forward slash NordVPN or you can go to NordVPN and use my discount code Adam Tan, and you'll be able to get that discount immediately. I've been using NordVPN now for the last couple of weeks. It's been really simple to use, really quick. I used to use a free VPN service that was just terrible. So when you're using the internet without a VPN normally, you are open to all kinds of attacks. People can actually find where you live. Whereas with something like NordVPN, your connection is encrypted. You are basically browsing the internet anonymously. It also means that you're that much more protected when you're using public unsecured Wi-Fi networks networks like the ones in schools, cafes, universities and libraries. Another thing that NordVPN is useful for is TV shows. For example, if I wanted to watch a TV show that is only available for watching in the United States, but not in Australia, I could just go to NordVPN and just click United States and then I can watch it. And of course, NordVPN is available on all platforms, Windows, iOS, Mac OS, Android, TV, anything you want. So if you're interested in the discount, it's at adamtanpercussion.com forward slash NordVPN, or you can use the discount code adamtan, or you can use the links in the description or the pinned comment below to get 70% off plus one month free on a brand new three year. NordVPN subscription. Okay, back to the video. Today we have two videos submitted which are completely different from each other. Both of them are marching related, but one of them is a DCR group that you probably all know and it's in the thumbnail. And the other group, which we're gonna watch first, is from Indonesia. So we've never watched any international drum corps competitions that are not DCI or WGI on this show before. So I'm really excited to check this one out, submitted by Syarul Andika. And it's basically an in the lot video, parking lot marching band, Citra Dara Bahana Yogyakarta State University at Indonesian Drum Corps Championship IDCC 2019. Yeah, IDCC, I'm assuming that's like DCI but in Indonesia. Cyril says, hi, I'm from Indonesia. It's my core, the Citra Dara Bahana Yogyakarta State University marching band from Yogyakarta, Indonesia. It's actually drum corps, DC. I don't know the reason why Indonesian people can't see the difference between drum corps and marching band. Well, to be fair, I didn't know the difference a year ago. So in the IDCC, my core got third place with every caption in third place. That's awesome. I need your opinion about my core in the parking lot or anything else you want to say. It's a full run through and it's also going to be focusing from the front and the sides of the instrument. I hope you like it. Well, I'm sure I'm going to love it because I've never seen an IDCC performance before, so let's watch. Okay, so here's the video. You can see it's an in the lot video and it looks like a very small parking lot. Look at all the trees that are in the way. Uh, I don't see any color guard. Maybe they're off screen or something. Anyway, I'm really excited to get into it, so let's go. Wow, that's a lot of mallet instruments in the pit. The brass sounds pretty good. 
and all the upstrokes are in time as well. Oh, the color guard is on the straight. <laughs> There's really not enough room, they have to be on the straight. That must be such an interesting sight for all the cars driving past. Hey, the brass sounds legit. And they have so many texts. Whoa, listen to those dots. Are these majestic marimbas? Yeah, they are majestic marimbas. Sounds good. Very together. I like how they, they all come down at the same time as well. <laughs> they go, oh! This is a cool, cool arrangement. I like that they have this little swagger going on. And it's pretty awesome too that their entire front ensemble is female. Oh, and down below. Okay, she was a little bit slow. There are very behind. Sense that humans have. Sometimes. This narration. What the eye okay. is not necessarily the same as what the ear is. And it's in English. Or vice versa. This drum core truly is universal. Interesting grad graduated mallet setup. She's using two white mallets and two black mallets. That's very interesting, especially on such a small instrument. What is more than one human? I appreciate the side view, cameraman. I appreciate the pit view. Thank you very much. <laughs> now this is really crowded, like this lot setup. And they don't have a big enough parking lot to do it because the actual parking lot has cars. Okay, no, I stand corrected. It's a pretty big <laughs> brass section, actually. Wow, these dance moves are so elaborate. So far, I'm not really seeing any difference between this and PCI. It looks like they're on the same level. It's not as it's not as difficult as world class level music, that's for sure. But still, very good. Oh, look at that run! Two mile run. No, go back to the rumors, damn it! <laughs> yeah, the brass flexes are much less in this arrangement. But they sound good. They sound they sound nice and even. I like that they have a dedicated suspended cymbal player as well. <laughs> uh, we got battery feature, which we can't see. Yeah, and all the hits are really precise too. I like that articulation. Mm, the visuals on the front ensemble, like as in the, the syncing of their movements could be a little bit tied up, but what do I know? I'm a, I'm a classical player. <laughs> I can't talk. <laughs> Man, this is, this is awesome. Whoa, getting down and low with the um, twilight style forest view. Okay, stop, stop pointing at the leaves, cameraman. Point at the players, man. Ah, now we can see the battery. Hey, there's quite a lot of them, actually. The, the, the drum course in Indonesia must be huge, if this is just one of their cores. Okay, so you can see, yeah, their parts are a little bit simpler than world-class parts, but quite together and quite good. Yeah, and their movements are also simpler. Dirty, but but still okay. <laughs> I love that they have to bring the, the quads up. That's that's an interesting move. It's pretty together. Yeah, let's go. Well, they have they have um. They have drum majors on every side <laughs> of the ensemble. There's ones at the back, ones at the front. 
I guess they have to compensate for a full length field. Oh, base solo, base solo, yeah! It could be a little bit more together, but still, still pretty good. Hey! Let's go, snare solo, snare solo. Doing a little bit of top secret style, looking down and looking up. <laughs> And the intent is there. Maybe they could have a little bit more energy. But it's tough, it is tough. And then Indonesia is like a humid country as well. You know, like, it's, it's difficult to rehearse in those conditions. And they're doing a great job. Hey! Nice! <laughs> this cameraman, this cameraman is getting way too excited. He's like, yeah, let's go, let's go, walk to the front. Alright, we've got mallet feature. Yeah, all the all the vibes players are super in sync. This person in the background appears to have dropped some. No, she's oh she's playing a violin! There's a violin! Electric violin in a drum core shirt. I never thought I'd see the day. Oh. That's cool. Yeah, let me know in the comments, have you, have you ever seen violin in a show? Maybe I've just never been submitted one with violin before. Sounds awesome. The vibraphone upstrokes are so sharp. It's interesting, like normally in the VCR performances I've seen, the vibraphone strokes are a lot more gradual for these kinds of long notes. I like how there's a guy just solely playing tambourine. That's dedication. Never underestimate small instruments. Yeah, look at that girl's face. That's awesome. See, the thing is, no matter what the difficulty level is or the skill level, like the intent is there and they're really enjoying the music. And you know, this style of music is very American and Western and they're just, they're just playing it. They're just killing it. Yeah. Let's go now! Boom! Hey, I like that they're smiling. That's really nice. They have so many drum majors. Yeah, they have like a narrator in, in the back. Whoa, that mouse solo though. <laughs> Oi! Nice. Hey, whoa. Very, very in sync single hits. Hey. Hey. Man, the is working hard. Working hard. Oh, they're using a mix of brands. That's an Adams Marimba. Yeah. I know Adams is really popular in Southeast Asia. Oh man, this <laughs> this drum age is like yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, this it sounds really good. The brass sounds really good. Yeah, wow. Hey. Wow. That's awesome. That's awesome. Okay, so it does look like this is a lot rehearsal, so they're still cleaning some things up. That's why they have so many techs running around. They have so many majors like conducting them in all different directions. I really love the addition of the violin. I really love the pit. Sure, it wasn't as advanced as something like SCVs, you know, four mallet octaves or whatever. Everyone seemed to be enjoying themselves. There was a real energy about it. Really solid performance, and it makes me want to check out other IDCC performances as well. 
which we might do. Let me know down in the comments if you'd like to see that. Anyway, if you're enjoying the video so far, I'd love it if you could give me a thumbs up. Let's check out the next video. So I love marimba and I love marimba features. And some of the marimba features we've seen on the show have been absolutely insane. This is probably going to be one of them. It's a submission from Stephen C. Couture. He says it's the 2014 DCI Cavaliers marimba feature. I believe a lot of you guys have been telling me to check this out. Check out any of the Cavaliers videos over the last couple of years. Very creative features. I'm very excited. Let's watch. All right, so this is the, um, <laughs> what a way to start the video. The Cavaliers Immortal, and it's only a one minute 50 video on the official DCI page. DCI, please don't demonetize me. <laughs> it looks like this might just be a highlight reel, so I might just pause it at parts that I find interesting, but yeah, let's have a look. All right, we've got the casual dancing with a skeleton, as you do. <laughs> Man. Whoa! Oh, it's a split pit. Okay, hold on. Okay, so we have what appears to be a split pit. We have, uh, I think these are electronics. I'm not entirely sure. That's timpani. That's the gong. Three xylophones, maybe a Glock somewhere. And then four vibraphones and the timpani. And then we have the marimbas over here. That's very interesting. There must be some sort of very fancy party trick coming up because if they're on the field, that usually means something epic is going to happen. Oh, oh there's two players for each member. All right. Oh, oh, spinning around. Here we go. Back to back. Wow. People really like to drive the marimbas around. Whoa. What? 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 He got, he's jumping on the marimba. What the? <laughs> hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. That was ridiculous. There was just so much going on. Look at this. So we've got people jumping behind each other and the way they're bringing the mallets up is so creative. And then over the back, turns in sync. And then this guy doing a little bit of a victory pose, Super Mario pose. And then this guy just gets up on the marimba and waves a flag. And then he falls backwards in a cheerleading position. That's, that's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. I think it's one of the best things I've watched all year. And we got some brass flexes. Oh, it's Dance Macabre. Of course it's Dance Macabre. <laughs> Wow, big, big grass flex, big grass flex. And maybe all these guys are doing removal list actions on the marimba. <laughs> oh, this is epic. Whoa, whoa. Man, they look so in sync, these guys. Whoa! With the with the stanky arm! I can do that too. Look, 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 ready? Oh <laughs> I haven't seen that move in years. That's ridiculous. That's just Yeah, this part is I mean this part's pretty normal, but that scale though. And the stanky arm to finish from everybody. That's Ridiculous. Well, that was an experience and a half. <laughs> That's one of the most ridiculous marimba features I've ever seen on this show. Uh, that was just ridiculous. The, the flipping and the going over the top and over the... What? What? That makes me so proud to be a marimba player. Like, there's so much you can do with the instrument. And they showed that with those amazing formations and playing behind each other. And the lines, I can tell they're very different to other core styles. Like, this one is more rudimental shall we say it's a lot of scales up and down single line it was really interesting to see how they've turned something that could potentially just be you know single line run after single line run to something really fascinating with all of these 
visual movements. Anyway, let me know what you guys thought of these performances in the comments below. That was just insane. What a way to end today's episode. And if you enjoyed today's episode, please give me a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it so much. And if you haven't already, please hit that red subscribe button below to keep up with my uploads and hit that notification bell so you know whenever I upload a brand new episode. As always, I'll be doing more of these. So if you want to submit your own videos, it's at adamsubscribe.com forward slash submit. And finally, I have an album coming out. Yes, after so many years of you guys telling me to upload my recordings to Spotify, Apple Music, etc. It's finally happening. You should be seeing my name appear very, very soon on Spotify and Apple Music and Amazon and TikTok and all that good stuff. Wow, I never thought I'd ever have an album out. But thank you so much to all of you guys who support the show, whether it's on these Let's Watch episodes, whether it's my pieces or the other episodes or anything that I make. Thank you so much for your support once again. And I'll see you guys next week for another episode of the studio. Good night. But then you fall back